We are here at the Yarbo booth. What is Yarbo? Well, how about a robotic, automated snowblower, lawnmower, leaf blower, uh, a general yard assistant that does it all by itself. And the best thing is I'm actually testing one of these right now. Fingers crossed for some snow, actually. Don't say that very often. We're here to find out more of what Yarbo is really capable of. Kevin, I'm kind of familiar with Yarbo because I'm actually testing one, but having to see all this in real life with all the different attachments, mm -hmm. tell people that aren't familiar with Yarbo what it's all about. Okay, sure, yeah. So basically the idea of Yarbo is to have the yard maintenance work all done by the robotics product, right? So we have the Yarbo here that can do the, a lot of works, like blowing the snow, cutting the grass, also blowing the leaves, or spreading some liquid on your ground. This is what we call the snowblower unit. So we have the modular design. As you can see here, it's the universal body. This is universal, you can have different, all the same bodies here. This is what we call the snowblower attachment, or we call the snowblower modules. You can switch modules from the snowblower to a lawnmower over there, or maybe a leaf blower over there or maybe a liquid spreader over here. So that'd be, you know, you could put uh, fertilizer. Fertilizer, or, waters. Or brine. Or, brine. You can, you can actually you can, put things on top. Exactly. And you can tow with it even. Yes, Right. exactly. Rumor has it that they actually towed a Tesla. That's how powerful and, and how much torque that it actually has. Now, yep. one thing that we haven't touched on, everything, you have a remote in your hand, but yep. you don't really need that, do you? No, this is just one of the options for me to control it. I'm mean, using this to have fun, you know? But most of the time, you can set up the auto autonomous plan on your cell phone, and you just hit click start button, that's it. You don't have to worry about, you know, how to blow the snow on your driveway anymore. But if you wanna have fun with the controller, I'll control it, and you can see how it works. There you go. It has slow speed, it also has fast speed. It can move up to 0.5 meters per second. You can raise the head lower it down. You can also turn the auger to different directions. The shoe direction. You can open the lights, turn it off. Uh, I'm going to turn on the auger. Okay, it's gonna get loud. You're going to hear it. Okay, maybe it sees the obstacle because well, they're the right. person. So it's not going to turn it on because it sees someone. Yes. Yeah, so there just for safety. Of, there are a lot of safeguards here. Yeah. So we have three cameras. There's one there. Yep. There are two on each side. Yep. Right there. And one thing that I was quite amazed at is that this, if you get a lot of snow, first of all, this has its own docking station. Mm -hmm. It will go and clean the dock off even before it docks if, it, if it's covered. But yep. those cameras are heated. It is heated. Right? Because we used to have the unheated camera and turns out the snow's going to cover it. So we put a heating element on the camera to make sure the camera is always open and clean. There's no snow or ice attached to it. Now, what's the docking station here? But yep. what is this unit here that we that we have? What's this here? So this is a new module we're coming for this year. This is a vision module. It is major for you know entertainment purpose. There's gonna be a face up here. You can check out this unit here. So this is the vision module. You can see it has the emoji face here. Yep. It shows different emotions because we pushed the emergency stop button. So it shows like it's frustrated because they cannot move anymore, right? <laughs> and we also have the camera here. It has the follow me function. So if you want to tour something with Yarbo and you don't want to control it, you just want to go by yourself, Yarbo is able to follow you behind you and all the way to wherever you want, as long as it's flat ground. So perfect if you're doing some, some landscaping, you have a whole bunch of yard bricks that you want to put in the yep. trailer. You don't want to actually have to carry them yourself. Mm -hmm. Use Yarbo. Use Yarbo to do that. And what, and what kind of capability do, does it have, the rover have for its tracks in, in terms of, you know, angles and, and terrain? So for the tracks, we can do 36, 30 to 33 to 36 degrees uh, when it comes to the slope on the lawn. For the driveway, when it comes to the snow area, it can do like 22 to 23 degrees. It will be a little bit slippery, so, the, you know, the degree will be lower. So, and then, you know, we're not going to get into all of it, how, how it actually, the, the app works, but you essentially map out your whole area mm -hmm. and, and then you can put no, no go zones yep. and, and um, it's fairly easy. It's fairly easy. I have to say though, you guys have 
great videos online showing how to do things. I actually started trying mine out and a couple of things I, I had questions, but I should have read the manual more. But the videos definitely help. Yep. Uh, so what else, is in, in, what else is in the future of Yarbo? So uh, for the future though, we're gonna have two versions of the body. So right now, as you can see, this body is what we have for the autonomous function and also the remote control. So for the future, we will have the advanced body, which will have, give you the ability to do the autonomous plan and also the, um, the teleoperation to help you live stream through the cameras. We are also gonna have an essential version of the unit, which will only give you the remote control, but much, much more cost efficient. The price will be even lower and you, all you need to do is to use your physical controller, control your elbow to blow the snow on your driveway. So you don't have to get out, you know, during the cold winter to, sh to shovel the snow by yourself. Let it down by your elbow. And how long has it taken to get to, you know, from prototype to, to this point now? Oh, that's a really long journey. You cannot imagine how much work we have done here. So we started our company in 2016. From now on, it's already almost eight years. At first, it was just a really simple, I gotta say a little bit piece of trash, you know, of the simple snowblower prototype. It broke right away after we used them. But we, we have a great team, you know, of engineers. We spend days and nights to test our unit in different places across the United States, Canada, Europe, a lot of different places. Um, take us about almost seven years. We also, you know, solve a lot of technical challenges such as um, we made the battery temperature, low temperature resistant, so the battery can work under the zero degrees of Fahrenheit. We also designed electronic stuff, also low temperature resistant, so even you know, during the winter, they should be working fine. We also changed the design from just the snow boat to the modular, so that now you can have you know, lawn mowers, snow blowers, leaf blowers, all the other yard maintenance tour you can have for your lawn. Wow, you know, that's, that's, that's pretty awesome. So, uh, how can people buy one? Well, for now, you can definitely go to our official website, yarbo.com. And we have a special promotion going on right now during the CES. It's $500 off if you purchase it with the promote code. Uh, you're gonna get, get a snow, actually, if you buy it now, you're gonna have a snow blower shipping right to you next week. Uh, the lawnmowers will be ready by this May or even June. But yeah, for sure, this year you're gonna see the lawnmowers and snowblowers in the market. Awesome, thank you so much. No problem.